The Congressional Gold Medal is one of our oldest traditions here in the Capitol. It is the highest civilian honor that this body can bestow. Today, pursuant to S-1555, we award this medal to the Filipino veterans of World War II. In return for their valor and sacrifice, the American government promised them citizenship and the benefits entitled to all veterans. In 1946, however, Congress sadly, shamefully, reneged on this promise and refused to grant these veterans the citizenship and benefits they earned. Their service was practically erased from American records. But even in the face of such adversity, these veterans never gave up. They organized and fought for what they had earned. Their story of struggle and perseverance has touched so many of us in Washington, and it's why so many of us fought so hard to award the Filipino veterans of World War II the Congressional Gold Medal, the highest civilian honor Congress bestows. Isn't this a happy, long-awaited, long-overdue day? For centuries, Filipinos have enriched our nation and made America more American with their courage, their determination, their optimism for the future. It is my pleasure to invite up to the stage six veterans and next of kin who will accept the medal on behalf of all Filipino veterans of World War II. Many have passed away waiting for 75 years for this time to come. I am Celestino Almeida, a 100-year-old veteran of World War II. After the war, thousands of us felt underappreciated and unrecognized for fighting for our country. Thank you all, and God bless America.